so today with the World Terror 5 release, they added two new exotic weapons. One of them being the M249 LMG that have an outcast theme. It's called Pestilence. So before we check the weapon more in detail, like talents and I tell you my thoughts, I thought I would just let you know how to get it, because it's actually super simple this time. So the Pestilent exotic actually drops in Dark Zone. It drops from the named bosses. I think it's actually only in Occupied Dark Zone since that's where the Black Tusk is. But I'm not 100% sure on that. But that's where I got it. So you just grind some Occupied Dark Zone landmarks and it shouldn't be hard at all to get. My whole group got it after a few hours. So the chances doesn't seem to be that low. You can get it as a contaminated drop or just a normal drop. Don't worry too much that it is in Dark Zone because Dark Zone is also the best way to farm. So you won't waste any time anyway, since it is World Tier 5, you still have to farm higher gear score. If we take a look at the gun itself, it's a M249 LMG with similar stats but with way lower base damage. And that is because of the talents. So we start with the first unique talent called Plague of the Outcast. After hitting the same enemy 20 times, that enemy is inflicted with Plague of the Outcast. Whenever an enemy with the Plague is killed, they leave a toxic cloud for 10 seconds that deals 200 weapon damage per second to anyone inside and inflicts them with the debuff Pestilence. And that's also the name of the second talent, which is a debuff that reduces healing received by 50% for 10 seconds. And whenever an enemy with Pestilence would get downed, they are actually instantly killed instead. And the debuff is removed if the enemy is repaired to full armor. Then we have the Holster talent and it's called Outcast Resilience. So while holstered, you get 20% bonus armor for 5 seconds whenever you are affected by blind, bleed or burning effect. So looking at the talents and also noticing that it drops in Dark Zone, it seems like they tried to make a PvP weapon, but in my opinion they failed. And they failed pretty hard. So you need to hit 20 bullets with this uh, Pestilence Exotic, which is a M249 base. So if we would use M249 though and hit 20 bullets, the target would already be dead like 2 or 3 times. But since the Pestilence have way lower base damage, he most likely won't die. But I mean, what is the reasoning to use that then? Like, why wouldn't you want to use a normal M249 when you kill him in like 10 bullets? So, so because of that, I don't really see it useful in PvP. Like, it just takes way too long. And on top of that, you can't get any rate of fire boost at all, since you can't equip any weapon mods. And you can't use the Shatterbox, for example, since, yeah, that's exotic too. So you're stuck with a 550 rate of fire. So yeah, I'm not too sure about this, but yeah, they should decrease the bullets from like 20 to maybe 10 or something like that to even make me consider using this for just fun. Otherwise, as I said, it's like a cool gun, but right now 20 bullets, way too much. And sure, people that have the debuff dies instantly, but so many times you can finish them off anyway in PvP. But maybe this could be useful in raids if there's any really tanky bosses and such. Otherwise, I don't see this gun being useful at all. And even looking at the holster talent, it's... Not too impressive, like I would not use it as a secondary most likely. But yeah, I'm super tired as you probably noticed. It's pretty hard to do this voiceover because I just grinded like 11 hour session on stream. But I really wanted to make a video about this since I've been covering all the exotic weapons. But yeah, I will be grinding the Vulture 5 tomorrow as well on stream if you want to check that out. But hope you guys found this video useful. And if you are interested in more guides or Division 2 videos in general, make sure to hit that subscribe button. See you in the next one.